It's hard, but the hardest part is getting the right guys with the right frame of mind to help you drive the vision. That's where recruitment comes in. And so we did some online research and we found Jobberman Ghana. My name is Elvis Kobi Aviaga. I'm the business operations manager for Lab Ghana. Lab Ghana is part of the Lab USA group. Lab Ghana is a technology company and we are focused on three main areas cloud managed services, IT consulting, and then providing offshore resources for US clients. Initially, we weren't too sure about the option they had on the site, and so we decided to go with the basic listing. And we were amazed at the result. The entire process was excellent. From the sign up, all through the job posting, as well as getting the resumes from the applicants, the entire process was functional and seamless. And so when you are dealing with some of these HR companies, you are not too sure about the next process. However, dealing with Job Urban Ghana, there is that sweet customer journey they take you through. So for every process you go through, you know what is happening next. So an example is the fact that when you make a job listing or you make a post, already Job Urban is able to tell you the kind of job seekers who are already available and that meets the criteria. And so already you know that people are available and you cannot let them about such a post. And so that gives you some measure of comfort, knowing that your ad is getting out there already and people are going to subscribe to it. So far we've hired a couple of people already and they are doing so well. They are performing at their peak. Very excellent performance with the right attitude as we wanted. We still have a few ads running and we are still interviewing a few other people as well. Dealing with Jobberman, I would say the experience has been great. The customer journey has been exceptional and the overall performance, I would say, it's flawless. I would recommend Jobberman for any employer who is seeking quality candidates, smart guys to work with. I'm an HR business partner. I have been practicing for close to three years now. I got my current job from Jobberman Ghana and I want to say a big thank you to Jobberman for giving me the opportunity to be connected to my employer. I heard about Jobberman Ghana from friends who had previously used Jobberman to land their dream jobs. The process was professional, highly systematic and the customer experience team was excellent. I got representatives reaching out to me firsthand to help out with my CV so I could stand out with my applications when applying for a job. And the CV really projected my skills and competencies. And like that, it, it really did the magic. I visited the platform as directed by a representative and applied for a number of jobs. For the first time in a long while, I had quite a handful of employers calling me in for an interview, which led to me landing a really great job. HR has always been my sweet spot, and so getting the opportunity to work directly within an industry and a profession I love is everything. I've had a lot of room for professional growth with my current employer, and I feel empowered to pursue higher in my chosen career path. Jobberman Ghana has been awesome, and I would definitely recommend Jobberman to family and friends. Because not only would you be applying for jobs, but you would also be coached to properly project yourself as a job seeker, which I think is very important when job hunting. Welcome everybody, my name is Genevieve and this is Jobberman. This is the Q&A session. Um, it's exactly 11, sorry, it's exactly 1, 11 p.m. here. And I welcome you all joining us on our live section. So today, we want to answer all the questions that you have as a job seeker, as an employer, how to find the best talent in Ghana. So we are here to help you. My name is Genevieve Amponsa, 
and I am the community marketer here at Joboman. So today to help me do all this will be our head of sales, Shifong Fuku, and also our customer experience manager, she is Anita Yaira Akuto. So Anita and Hilda, can you hear me? Yes, we yes. can. Hello, <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you. Thank yes, you. yes. So we have a lot of questions from job seekers and employers looking for the brightest and then the best in Ghana. So without wasting much time, before I think before the session, I had a few questions coming in. But before that, I would like to share with you what we do at Jobberman. So if it's the first, very first time you are hearing about Jobberman, Jobberman is a recruitment platform in Ghana and we are in Accra, yes. So it's a digital pr platform. Whoever you are, whether you're a job seeker, you're an employer, looking for quality professionals to help your business grow, Jobberman can help you do that, yes. So at Jobberman, we, 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 we basically connect employers to job seekers and job seekers to opportunities. So if you just joined us, thank you for joining. If you have any question, please don't hesitate to just drop them in the comment section and we'll get them answered. Okay, so Hilda, um, okay, I think, I think the very first question should go to uh, Anita. Anita, so on a normal day, how many job listings do we get? On our website, Anita, if you can hear me, um, we, get, uh, we get between ten and twenty a day. Okay, so which means that at every point in time, there are new roles available for anybody looking for a job. Come again, please. Yeah. So I was asking on a normal day. How many listings do we get or do we get listed on our website? Um, on a daily basis, between 10 and 20. Oh, okay. Okay. So for anybody looking for any job, when they come to the website at any point in time, they are sure to get what they are looking for. Yes. Okay. So um, can you also tell us the specific jobs that are very on the rise, like on the on the high side, how many which which type of jobs are being listed? Is it sales, marketing, or teaching jobs or whatsoever? Okay, for now, because most of the schools have now reopened, we are getting a lot of teaching roles, teaching jobs. So in the field of education and also because of the COVID. You know, most of us, most companies are now going the digital way. So we have a lot of IT and telecom roles as well. That's the highest, although we have other roles on our platform. Oh, okay. So I, I got a message from somebody saying, um, is it only corporate jobs that are listed on Jobberman? Like the white collar jobs, is it only the white collar jobs we have on Jobberman? No, we also have blue color jobs. These okay. Jobs. So blue color jobs, can you mention any? Okay, Let's blue color jobs like um, tricycle riders, um, uh, carpenters, drivers, pretty men. Okay. Oh, okay. So how about somebody looking for a job like a shop attendant? Um, I would not call a shop attendant a blue color job. Okay. A blue color job is a, these are jobs that are for people who, are, who probably would have gone to, let's say, some form of, um, who have some form of education, but that have not gone to, uh, don't have too much of a formal education. Okay. So are, the, are these jobs specifically listed on our website or there is a specific platform for those kind of jobs? These jobs are listed on our, our platform. The blue collar jobs? Yes. Okay, so I have a message here from Prince Pablo. Prince says, I'm currently looking for a workshop technician job in Ghana. How can we help Prince? Um, Prince has to go to our website, www.jobberman.com 
page, he has to go to our site and create a job seeker profile. Mm -hmm. When he, se he selects the job seeker, he you you get a, a set of questions that he has to answer. So he needs to complete all those for us, and then after he does that, he now has a profile on our platform. What he does is to go ahead and then look for those jobs that have been advertised on our platform, and then the ones that he qualifies. So does it mean that if you do not have a job seeker um, account, you can't apply for a job on Jobberman? Because of how the, the system is, you would have to have a job seeker account to be able to apply to a job on our, on our platform. Okay, so which means it's mandatory? Yes. Okay, so our next question is coming from... Um, Okay, Bokai, thank you for watching. We can see you. Pakash, okay, Pakash also watching. Okay, so if you're watching and then you want to send a message, let me know where exactly you are watching us from. If you are watching us from, let's say, Kumase, you are in Obwase, you, wherever you are, let's know where it's from. And you can even add what you do to it. And if you're looking for a job, let us know. We can help you on that. And okay. This is coming from Philip. Philip Ajuman says, I'm a fresh graduate and I'm looking for a new job and I have experience. What can we do for Philip? <laughs> I think it's the same question that the other guy, okay, so it's been answered. All right, all right, all right. Um, so in this era of remote work, yes, people are working remotely, people are hiring remotely, um, what are some of the jobs that are really, really being, pe pe people are really looking for to join their team? For example, if a business is looking for digital marketers or they are looking for graphic designers, which type of jobs and skill strength are really needed in this type of, in this era of the pandemic? Um, Hilda, I don't know if you can help me with that. Yeah, because I mean, with COVID and everything, everybody's looking at better ways of working, digital ways of working, so that we are working more from home. So, I mean, companies are looking more for IT roles and roles in, so even with advertising and media, people are looking for social media managers to promote their business. People are also looking for, for IT, like um, data, um, data scientists, data analytics, you need to have some coding skills as well. So the IT jobs are on the rise because people are looking at ways and means to make them more efficient digitally. So that's um, the kind of jobs people are looking for. And if you talk about digital, I mean, you're in the right place. Jobberman, um, we actually do the entire recruitment uh, on our platform where we don't even actually accept hard copy CV. So if you bring it here, it's, it's just paper. What we will do, as Anita said, was go onto our website um, fill in your profile, log in, and you're able to be a job seeker. And even for the employers, they're able to sign in um, into a, a um, platform or a website as an employer. And they have we have what we call the application tracking system where they can post their jobs and we approve it internally. And they can also go into the ATS, which is the application tracking system, and sort out the CVs and and decide to do the interviews. Interviews can also be done digitally. They can do a Zoom interview. And you know, people have done interviews and people are, from our survey that we did on the impact of COVID survey, employers are looking, are able to give people offer letters without even meeting them in person. So if you're looking for a job within this time frame, you need to be abreast with time and try the digital ways of doing things. Okay, so can we say, in this period, employers are looking for people who are digitally inclined? Yes, yes, absolutely. Absolutely. So for any, any role that you're doing, you need to be able to know how to use your computer. You need to be able to use your Zoom. You need to be able to know um, digital ways of working, using Slack, Hangouts. You know, so you, you if you're a job seeker, you need to make sure that you are up, up there in terms of trying to um, in the improve your digital skills. It makes you more um, resourceful and more, I, I mean, marketable for employers. Oh, okay, thank you very much. So I think we just go for a break. And when we come back, we'll read the rest of the messages we have from our viewers.
Kezia and I'm an HR business partner. I have been practicing for close to three years now. I got my current job from Jobberman Ghana and I want to say a big thank you to Jobberman for giving me the opportunity to be connected to my employer. I heard about Jobberman Ghana from friends who had previously used Jobberman to land their dream jobs. The process was professional, highly systematic, and the customer experience team was excellent. I got representatives reaching out to me firsthand to help out with my CV so I could stand out with my applications when applying for a job. And the CV really projected my skills and competencies. And like that, it, it really did the magic. I visited the platform as directed by a representative and applied for a number of jobs. For the first time in a long while, I had quite a handful of employers calling me in for an interview, which led to me landing a really great job. HR has always been my sweet spot, and so getting the opportunity to work directly within an industry and a profession I love is everything. I have had a lot of room for professional growth with my current employer, and I feel empowered to pursue higher in my chosen career path. Jobberman Ghana has been awesome, and I would definitely recommend Jobberman to family and friends. Because not only would you be applying for jobs, but you would also be coached to properly project yourself as a job seeker, which I think is very important when panting. Number five, shortlisting. Jobberman has a shortlisting feature that allows me to efficiently review hundreds of applications in a simplified format, and I no longer have to sort through hundreds of paper CVs. With shortlisting, all I have to do is select the applicants that I want to review, and it automatically sorts them into categories of my choice. And that's why thousands of employers choose Jobberman. Reasons why employers use Jobberman. Reason number four, matching algorithm. Jobberman has a matching algorithm that uses a candidate's profile information and qualitative assessment scores to find the best matching candidates for your role, thereby making it easier for you to pick the best fit. And that's why thousands of employers choose Jobberman. One of my major challenge in recruitment has always been finding the right candidate. And you know, sometimes when you decide to advertise a role, getting the right CV, or let me say the best fit for the role is a problem. So you advertise the role, you end up getting a lot of CVs. In fact, a lot of CVs that do not even relate to the job role, and it becomes a problem. And My name is Irene Austin. I'm um, the Human Resource Manager for Uton Engineering. And um, Uton is a telecom consortium. In fact, we are the number one telecommunications consortium in Ghana. And uh, we have clients such as MTN, Vodafone, and the others, and Google as well. Um, I've been in the human resource industry for barely about seven years now. Dealt with about 200 um, um, human resources and um, I must say it's it's been quite an experience so that's basically it. So far I have used about two services from Jobberman. I have tried the, the job listing and the best match. The job listing I literally asked um, for that service just to see get some CVs and go through them myself. I had time then but I think my favorite was actually the best match. The best match was way better i think and um, the mere fact that i could save a lot of time looking at the, my tie schedule all i had to do was to get three best candidates and in fact maybe it posed a little challenge because we were supposed to fill just one row we ended up taking two because among the three you couldn't even tell which of them to to pick so i think the best match was actually the best so far i have recruited about four candidates from jobberman and um, i'll just take one instance my now my head of operations, I recruited him as a health and safety manager. He grew to be the operations manager and now the head of operations. And this was all within a span of just a year. So she told you the kind of 
scale we are getting on board, the quality of candidates that I've gotten from Jobberman. And as a result, I've even recommended to a few of my colleagues in the industry and I must say it's been good so far. So with Jobberman Ghana, I would recommend Jobberman on any day to any HR. Why? Because I think that they help to save a lot of time and also if you want the quality for your money, you have to fall on Jobberman Ghana. Welcome back. So if you want quality for your money, fall on Jobberman Ghana for all your recruitment needs. If you're an employer looking for the best and the brightest, Jobberman is here for you. So currently we are running a campaign called the Fehu Kimi campaign. This campaign is a special one just for employers like you looking for qualified candidates. So without wasting much time, let me ask Hilda. So Hilda, yeah, Hilda. Yes to talk to us about the Fehu Kumi campaign. What exactly is it about? Okay, so this campaign is to let employers know about our um, skills assessment campaign. We do have a skills assessment which helps augment people's um, application. So let's say if you, you're you recruiting for maybe an administrator or a finance manager and you will want to know who can actually do the job because you know people will put a lot of fancy things on their CV that they can do this, they can do that. But when you come onto the real life job, they might not be able to do that. So this so assessment will help you to be able to determine who can actually do the job. And these are not, um, let's say, hypo, um, they are not questions, they are practical questions, where it's on the job questions, where we ask you, so things that if you're a finance person, you're expected to know are the kind of questions that are in the skills assessment. So we do, um, let's say, finance, we'll do the fundamentals, we'll do a bit of, so that we know that actually if you have a finance certificate, you can actually do a finance job. So once you put in a job, we can add a, a list in the assessment to it and people will take the assessment as part of the um, application process. Once they pass the assessment, then you can take them to the next level of the interviews. Um, and I think this is, um, it used to be 850 CDs for just the assessment. But today we are doing a, a campaign for 700. And what it is is that you will, we give you some, um, a 150% a 150 Ghana cities discount off the assessment. But the good thing is we are throwing in uh, a free job listing. So when you do that, you don't have to pay for the listing. You get, get the listing for free as well. And we, will be, we want people to know the value of the assessment, use them more. It will save you a lot of hassle, to save you a lot of headache. Because we do have these complaints where people say, oh, the person was really good. And when they came on the job, they can't perform. How would you know? So a school assessment is ways employ employers can use to test if people are actually capable of what they said they will be able to do. So this is a wonderful campaign and we are hoping that job um, employers will be able to hook up onto it at a good price. Okay, so I have a message coming in from Efia. She says she's watching us all the way in Kumasi and she's asking, is it only limited to specific employers or who qualifies? Oh, every employer. So if you are on our uh, platform as an employer, you are qualified. Actually, we, so we, we, we are planning to have and a, a new, well, I don't know if it's a good time to bring it in, but <laughs> we, let's say- It's only a good time? Yes, so if we are an employer, you qualify. If you're already okay. on our platform and you want to refer someone, we're going to have a, um, what we call refer and earn. And you refer another employer and you get access to it, you will give you one eight, 850 skill assessment credit and you can use for your next uh, so if you're doing your next job listing, you can use the assessment. So once you refer another employer, you get that. And when the, the employer also purchases, they also get that. So that's also something that we are looking to launch in a couple of months. So it's for all employers. And if you can refer, I think maybe in, in the next month or two, you also get an assessment credit. Okay, so I think she, she sent a follow-up question. And she's saying, um, for example, if I am new to the, to the, to the platform, do I still qualify for the fair who came in? Yes, you do qualify. You do okay. qualify. It's, it's for okay. a specific time frame only. So you take you take advantage of it now and you can qualify for the assessment credit. I think it's a spot at the end of March. I can. Yeah. All right. I have this one here coming from Michael Brobe. Michael says, I'm watching you from Kumase and I have been 
MSc Information Technology, and I'll be graduating with the MSc Information Technology in two weeks' time. Is it possible to get a job in information technology? Is it possible for him to get a job on Jobberman? Anita? Yeah. Yes, it's very possible. It's possible. Okay. So, Michael, there very you go. Possible. Just have to sign, sign, up like like and, and sign up as a job seeker. And then after you sign, he signs up as a job seeker, he goes in there to look through the jobs that he qualifies for and then apply for those jobs. Okay. okay. Um, APSHC Mensa is watching us all the way. Okay, he said Ghana. Thank you for watching. Um, Agnes, would you... Hello? Hilda, were you saying something? No, no, not yet. Okay, so I have this one here from Agnes. Agnes says, what is the job outlook for people with biomedical science? I'm currently in USA. So I think maybe she wants to relocate to Ghana. Agnes, okay, I, I think it's, it's a field that is not very, it's not a popular field, but it's a field that is in high demand. So if she's looking at relocating to Ghana, that's the best time. She should come in, she should just sign up and start doing the applications from there. And once she's ready to come in, she will have some interviews lined up for her. But that's the best time. I mean, it's a, a field that is not very popular, but it's in high demand. And once she signs up, she'll be able to find a job. Okay. Edith Gaumensa says, are there any vacancies for business administrators? Are there any vacancies for business administrators on Jobberman? This is an there are lots, there are lots, a lot of that. Okay. So just make sure, they should also make sure that while they're signing up as job seekers, they should make sure their profile is complete and then just go to okay. the site and they will definitely get something that qualify for. Okay. Okay. Um, before, before the Q&A, somebody sent in a message and I, I he was asking, he said, um, he's been applying for jobs for the past three or five years, and he's still not getting a job. So what exactly is the problem with such a person? Okay. Such a person should make sure that his profile is one complete, and also make sure they apply for jobs that they qualify for. Sometimes some of the people, when an, an employer puts up a job post, they give specifications as to what they are looking out for. So just make sure that you fall within the brackets that the employer is looking for because if you don't then that's where you apply for so many jobs somebody is an accountant and is applying for an exam like an it job which you know you don't really fall you have yeah, some really experience fun. in it but not what the person is actually looking for so just make sure you apply for what you qualify for and I, i'm sure okay. you get what you're looking for how about somebody who has a profile up to let's say 75% and is still not getting a job on job on one. What exactly must the person do? Um, ideally, when you complete your profile, it helps a lot because it's not, you don't just do the, the you, you can apply for jobs, but we also go in there to also sort out CVs and profiles for other employees. So if your profile is not complete, I won't be able to get all the information I need when I go there sorting for an employer that has come to me to do that for him or her. So ideally, complete your profile and it gives you a 100% chance of always being picked or being picked when there's an, issue, there's an opportunity like that. So I have this message here. Hello, Anita. Use my 
In this role, um, I have had to recruit new staff all the time. Uh, a number of challenges undertaking this particular piece of, of my work. And some of the challenges have to do with finding space in the newspapers and the time it took and all that until I found Job of Mine. My name is Winfred Ofei. I serve as human resource business partner for Compassion International Ghana. I, Compassion International Ghana um, exists to provide opportunities for children uh, to grow and become fulfilled Christian adults in the future. I got to know about Joboman when I, we had to do a search for job boards um, online that we could use to post um, jobs. We found out that Jobberman was one of the most popular sites that we could use. As I was looking for solutions to the many recruiting challenges I was facing, we, we embarked on the search uh, online for appropriate job boards that we could use to launch our recruitment and talent, um, uh, talent search. And in the process, we found Jobberman. So, in terms of the products, we have been using, uh, uh, we have had a preference for, 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 for the job listing site and it has served us so well um, um, even so now. And as I said here now, we are actually now getting ready to do a job posting to Job of Man. Okay, so basically, I, I enjoy using the basic listing and particularly the employer's summary page, uh, which summarizes for us and the number of candidates who have applied for the position that we have posted. And this is very helpful and also a user-friendly, very user-friendly um, form for us as uh, compassion. So I would recommend Jobberman as a, a very good, um, an excellent um, job board that we can use when we want uh, quality talent to hire in, in the Guardian market.
Okay, so welcome back. My name is still Genevieve Amponsa, and I am your moderator for today's Q&A session. So I think we were answering a question and then something happened. Um, so sorry, we, we, we're dealing with technology and you know, internet can sometimes be a brother to us. So let me welcome back my guest. So I think Hilda was was responding to a question from, um, he said, okay, okay, yes. So this is the question. He said, I've been, okay. I remember I applied for an IT job and my status changed to shortlisted, but I, I was never called. In fact, my profile is 100% complete. So please, can you help explain? I hold HND Computer Network Management Certificate and also holds a professional certificate in CCNA Essentials. So with this type of person, what exactly is the problem? Anita. It's, it, it's, it, it mainly has to do with applying for the jobs that you qualify for. So if he's applying, if his profile is 100% complete and he's applying for jobs he qualifies for, then that should be, a, that should be an issue there. Okay, so there's a question from Richard Che. Richard says, I'm told you have VIP membership. How true is that? Um. <laughs> we, do not, we do not have VIP membership. I think everyone is a VIP. I mean, one of the goals or, or one of the aims of um, Jobberman is democratize recruitment so that everyone has a fair chance of getting a job. So you don't need to know anybody. You don't need to have a VIP treatment or a VIP pass to get a job. Once the job, so what? that's why sometimes we even make the, the employers, some of the employers are anonymous. We put up a job, you apply, if you qualify for the job, you get called for an interview. I mean, okay. it's, it's as easy as, as that, and there's no membership, and there's no, um, I mean, high level membership that you need to have. I think we want to make sure that everyone has a fair chance, an equal chance of getting a job if they apply for it. Okay, so there's another one from Imano Mante. Imano says, how are recruitments done? Because I've applied for what I'm qualified for, but still I'm not getting the job. <laughs> Anita. So what's, um, I wish I could get um, him to answer some other questions for me, but um, is it that he's never called for any interview at all, but he's applying for jobs that he qualifies for? Okay, so I think Emmanuel. Because at least he will, get, he, he will at least get shortlisted and then at least go for some first level of interview. So if it's at that level, then then probably um, probably depends on how the interview goes. But ideally, if he's applying for the jobs he qualifies for, he should at least get shortlisted for some interview. Okay, so Sevia, Sevia Samia for says. How do I register to become a member? I think he's a job seeker. I think we said earlier, go onto our website, www.jobberman.com.gh and click the right profile. Look for a job seeker. So that you're not an employer, so don't go for an employer side. Go on the job seeker side and fill in the questions, upload your CV and make sure that you filled your profile up to 100%. Then you can start applying for jobs on our on our portal. Okay, so I have Edith asking us, do you help applicants in polishing up their CVs? Yes, we do. That's a service that we, we, we offer. So you have to, it depends on what exactly you want to be done on your CV. You'd have to pay something for us to work on your CV for you. Yes, we do that. Sure. Okay. I just wanted to emphasize that it's the only service that we charge job seekers for. So Jobberman does not charge job seekers for give, um, linking them up with an employer. We don't charge you for getting a job. The only service we charge is a CV service. So if you feel like your CV needs a bit of revamp or you need to do some work on your CV, we have different packages. And if you come onto our website, you can be able to, or you call our, our, our numbers on there, someone will be able to attend to you. But that's the only service where we do charge job seekers something for it. 
but not for okay. employers. Okay, okay. So AD3, hope your question has been answered. And okay, so going back to the skills assessments, you were talking about skills assessment and how employers can use that to get the best out of the lot. So if, for example, there is a job on the website and then a job seeker wants to apply, what exactly happens? So once, there you, once you apply for the job, you need to fill, so if there's an assessment, you need to take that assessment test. If you don't take the assessment test, your application won't be completed. So you could, you can apply and think that, oh, I have applied for the job and be crossing your leg waiting for an, uh, a call for an interview. If there's an, an assessment attached to it, it will show that as an assessment and you need to complete the assessment. So um, the results of the assessment will also determine who the employer calls for the next level of the interviews. So All right. Once you do your application, you add the assessment to it, and then it will be complete. Okay, so does it mean that if the person doesn't um, answer those questions pertaining to the assessment, the uh, application will not be successful? Because there yes. are sometimes we get we get job seekers sending in messages, hello, I've been applying for this job for some time now, but it keeps bouncing. Then later on, go and check, and it looks like there's an assessment, but they... They didn't know how to go about it. So what exactly must they do? Are there any steps? Um, they would have to take the assessment first. So if you if you're applying for a job and there's an assessment, you have to take the assessment test first. Then after the assessment test, you go ahead to apply. Okay. Okay. So they have to make sure that they respond to all the questions attached to the job listing before they can apply for the job finally. Yes. Okay, so if you are watching us and you have been experiencing these difficulties, then it means that you are not doing the right thing. So when you're applying for any job and it has a skills assessment, make sure you respond to all the questions and then your application will be successful. Okay, I have another. All right, all right. Patience, one, one, one penny is okay, is watching. Thank you, patience. Keep the messages coming. Um, Abu Bakar Amina says, any work for me, I'm jobless. <laughs> <laughs> Amina, we have a lot of jobs on Joboman currently. I think currently we have 300 and over 300 jobs listed on the website. So you just log on to www.joboman.com.gh, set yourself up as a job seeker, and then find your new opportunity there, depending on your qualifications and what exactly you want you'll find it there. Okay, so, all right, all right, all right. Carol is also watching. Carol, thank you for joining us. So if you also just joined us, this is a Q&A session with us, Joboman, and Hilda is helping us answer all the questions. Hilda is our head of sales here at Joboman Ghana. Anita Yaya Akoto is our customer experience manager here at Joboman. why employers use Jobberman. Reason number one, skills assessments. Jobberman has a skills assessments feature that allows me to use curated role specific tests to assess the skills of applicants applying for my jobs. This ensures that I can objectively say the candidates I pick are capable of doing the job. And that's why thousands of employers choose Jobberman.
product, use Jobberman. Reason number four, matching algorithm. Jobberman has a matching algorithm that uses a candidate's profile information and qualitative assessment scores to find the best matching candidates for your role, thereby making it easier for you to pick the best fit. And that's why thousands of employers choose Jobberman. Thank you for still being with us. We have a few minutes to end the program. I'm still here with Hilda and Anita helping us answer all your questions you have about finding the best talent for your job and then you, the job seeker, looking for new opportunities. We're still here. So, um, okay, okay. Pakash, Pakash says, I, okay, Pakash, uh, okay, Pakash says, I'm here from Nepal in Asia and I'm watching. All right, thank you. Um, I'm here to, okay, okay. <laughs> all right, all right, Nepash, thank you for watching all the way from Asia. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so we have a few minutes to go. I would like Hilda to elaborate more on the refer and end. You mentioned it earlier that we have an upcoming campaign of which if you are an employer and you're already on Jobberman, you can refer to us, you can refer us to your circle of friends, your family who are looking for new people to join their team. And there is a special prize for you. Can you tell us more about that? Okay, so we have a refer and end of uh, which is going to be a rolled up really soon. So what it is is that we and for our employers on our website who use us and promote our business, we want them to be able to refer us to their other employer friends, someone looking to recruit people. And what you do is that you don't refer for nothing. When you refer, you do get um, uh, what we call a, a skills assessment credit. So the assessment credit, which is which is now going on an off a promo, which is 700, will go back to its original original price of 800. So you do get an, uh, an assessment credit which you can use. So the next time you refer someone and you have a, a, a job listing or you're doing a best match service or whatever service you're doing, whether it's executive recruitment or professional recruitment, you can attach the assessment that you've earned from referring someone to your job. And when you also refer the employer, once the employer purchases, they also get an assessment credit as well. So we want to be able to showcase our assessment to so that employers know the benefits of it and what it can do for it. It, it takes a lot of hassle in terms of, because people do tend to say a lot of things that they can do so when they come for interviews and have very big things on their CV. And when you, they actually start, you realize that that is exactly not the case. So this skill assessment will be able to help you sit through the, um, because you, once we post a job, we do have around 200, applications per role. So, I mean, it will be good to sift through and make sure that when you're picking, you're picking the right people who can do the job. And with the skills assessment um, uh, promo that will be referred and when you refer, you do get a skill assessment. And once the referred person also purchases, they also get a, a skill assessment credit. So that will be an exciting time. And we look forward to employers um, signing up, referring and earning. And if you refer, no matter how many you refer, you do get the assessment and you can use them uh, when you do your next um, listing or your next posting for jobs. Okay, so if I refer, for example, more than 10 people, I still get... You will get your assessment credits, yes. Okay. 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 Um, when, if you're referring, you, you, get the, you get the assessment once the person you referred has made a purchase. So that's because somebody might refer 10 people and they will just be on our platform and not really do anything and expect mm. to still get assessment. You won't get okay. it. You get it only when that the new person you refer to us makes a purchase. Then you get your assessment and the new person also gets an assessment. Okay. Is it only for employers or? Yes, yes. for employers. Okay. Okay. Is this okay. employer? 
Okay, I have a question here from Abbas Nuruddin. Abbas says, I'm a national service person at Kajil Ghana Limited, and I'm a laboratory technician willing to, who will be finishing service this year. And I want to write letters to organizations to be attached as a voluntary service to them. How do I go about it? How do I go about it? Okay, Abbas, thank you for your for your, for your question. So Anita, can you help Abbas with this? Abbas can also sign up on a platform as a job seeker. We have internships, companies who are looking for interns. Some, some, most interns probably may not pay, some are paid interns. So you can do, um, have your profile on a platform and then apply for those internship roles. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you, Anita. All right. Light Agbovi says, I, I have HND in civil, civil engineering. Can I get a job? Yes, exactly. You can get a job on job of mine. You can yeah. get your job on job of mine. There are lots of companies looking for people like you. So Light, Light Agbovi, just log on to Joberman, set yourself as, as a job seeker and find your next opportunity right now. Don't wait too long. Somebody may take it away from you. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Somebody may take it away from you. So um, I have another question here from Christian Kessi Dakwa. Um, the requirements was one to three years experience and the qualifications was, I think he sent a message earlier and the inter there was a problem with our internet, so we couldn't finish answering his question. And was diploma or HND in IT, which I qualified for, but I was not called for interview. Okay, maybe just a, a follow up on that. You know, some of the rules where um, our employers do a job listing, we don't have much of a control over who they pick. So when they do the job listing, they go onto our application tracking system and they do the shortlisting themselves. So the employer goes in there and look for people that they think qualify for the job and pick them. So what I would say is that keep applying, and I'm sure that once you, I mean, the more you apply, you, you, you increase the probability of getting a job. But if your profile is 100% and you think you qualify for these jobs, keep applying, and I'm sure that you will find um, your dream job very soon. Okay, all right. Thank you very much, Hilda. Thank you. Um, I think we can end our show in the next few minutes. Yes, our time is almost up. So I'd like Anita to say her last words and we can. Okay, um, what I'll say is I I think the most of our job seekers are talking about not getting jobs and applying and all that. I would encourage them like, that just said they should just complete their profiles and then make sure they apply for jobs they qualify for and then i would also say that they should not give up they should keep applying for those rules and i'm sure very soon they'll get the job that they really their dream jobs that's what i have to say okay and hilda something for our employers so we i mean jobberman will be your trusted hr partner your recruitment firm um, you will, we have the job seekers on our platform to enable you fill the roles. If you come to us, we have the service portfolios, whether you want to do a listing, whether you want to do a professional recruitment, we are able to support you all the way till you find your, um, your best candidates for the roles. And we do have the numbers of job seekers on our platform. So this is the right place to be. And we, we hope that we get more employers signing up and those who sign up will be satisfied with the job that we give them. So. We are looking forward to your next job posting and your next recruitment. We will be here to help. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So this has been our Q&A session here. And thank you all who joined us. If this was the very first time, now you know about Jobaman. In Ghana, we are the leading recruitment platform here. We connect job seekers to opportunities and we connect
help with an, an assessment has an assessment tag on it. We inform job seekers when a job has an assessment. They can click to learn more about why the job has an assessment. After filling the application form, job seekers can then proceed to take the assessment. The job seeker is then redirected to the assessment window. These tests are mobile friendly also, so job seekers can take them on both laptops and mobile phones. We show the job seeker a set of instructions for the test and they can click to begin when ready. Once the if you want to know more about the Jobberman assessment product, please call us on 054 290 46 